Hello, Zay Automotive Reviews. Today we have the 2021 Ford Bronco prototype spied with the apparent pop-up roof tent. And it looks amazing, folks. When the 2021 Ford Bronco was revealed a few months ago, Fomo Cole was quick to note that when the rugged SUV arrives next June, it will do so with a full catalog of 200 plus accessories. Considering how much Jeep Wrangler owners love to customize their rigs, it would be a huge miss for the Blue Oval not to take advantage of this opportunity. Now we don't want you to yet know what all those accessories are, but this 2021 Ford Bronco prototype might reveal at least one of them. One of them. And man, 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 look at this baby. This baby is nice. Now, the, the four-door 2021 Ford Bronco prototype looks quite strange at the first glance. You look at it, when I did see this, I did not think that it was a pop-up tent. And this looks strange because this thicker roof is covered in black camel. That appendage could be some sort of new top design. But it also might be a roof-mounted, slim, lying pop-up tent for camping. Some have speculated that this could be a power retractable soft top, much like the Jeep Sky One Touch Power top. But it seems a bit too thick for that, unless that's intentional to hide its design. And I believe it is intentional to hide the design. I mean, look at that. I mean, if they can <laughs> imagine if they can do it like that and then that it's just like that, but there's a pop up tent. I mean, if they can make it this slim like that, which would be amazing, and it'd be a pop up tent. That would be straight up amazing. Now, plenty of Beth Market companies sell roof mounted pop up tents for the Wrangler that are similar to the size to this one. However, Jeep does not offer one from the factory. So my Ford be looking to one up them in this regard? It would make sense, especially since the Blue Oval already sells rooftop tents for various other models in this lineup. So it's actually a shoe in It's definitely gonna happen, folks. Now whatever might be, or whatever might lie under this strange looking Camo remains a mystery. However, at least for now, it's, the, it's in the coming months we'll see one of the largest onslaughts of the factory and aftermarket parts and accessories in history as the Ford Bronco figures to be nothing more than a blank canvas for owners to build upon. And that's what makes this Ford Bronco, the, you know, amazing, folks, is that you can build it from this canvas and just make it awesome. I mean, look at this. Look at the thickness. Look at the, all that. It got me thinking. Wow. Could it be a bigger t It's definitely, it's definitely amazing. Just look at that. It's definitely got me thinking, you know, just looking at this and just making the mind. And this is how Ford, you know, they're doing a great job with these concepts and creating uh, an environment that <laughs> anticipation is just killing you. And uh, it's just killing, you know. And it's just, I mean, it's just awesome too, just the anticipation for this new Ford Bronco. The Bronco just coming, you know, just coming at us. And the Ford Bronco, definitely an awesome sports utility vehicle. And it's just awesome in every way, folks. And this one is just, you know, it's just awesome from the lights, from the wheels, from the uh, the tires, the um, fenders. Everything about it is just nice. You can remember the Ford Bronco 
initially came to be in 1966 and went through generations before being uh, discontinued in 1996. Um, Bronco returned in 2021, modern year as a mid-sized sports utility vehicle. And that's what makes it, you know, and that's what makes it awesome. Such a, a history, a rich history for the Ford Bronco. And um, such anticipation. And the more you see this, just the more you fall in love with it, uh, this Ford Bronco. The more you fall in love with the design, the more you fall in love with the accessories that's coming, that's going to make this, you know, all the more awesome. The more you fall in love with the retro looks of this baby and how it just leaves your heart just pounding. And we're all waiting with anticipation, you know, of what's going to happen um, with all the accessories, 200 plus accessories. I mean, all this, all, all new Ford Bronco. And all the way back from 1996, the Bronco popularity has only grown stronger in a quarter century since, prompting the automaker to bring back the wild SUVs in two configurations, and that is the uh, two-door and also the four-door versions. Um, with the new Bronco, you know, Ford's created a mixture of heritage-inspired styling, smart off-road technology and engineering, and a host of innovative features designed to one-up the segment steward, the uh, Jeep Wrangler. Ford says that the uh, Bronco was built with the toughness of an F-Series truck, and I believe that. And performance spirit of a Mustang, that's just what a mix, which makes for one of interesting and capable adventure vehicle. And that's what makes it nice. Now, the main goal of the new Bronco is to provide customers with a maximum four-wheel drive, go-anywhere, anytime capability and confidence. As such, it features some pretty impressive new technology to help, you know, such as the off-road mapping technologies, exclusive terrain management system, the go, go over any terrain uh, model, seven driver selectable models, are offered, including the normal Eco Sport and Slippery and Sand with the Baja Mud Ruts and Rock Crawl off-road features. I mean, cruising through the rocks at a slow speed, knowing, you know, just knowing where you're planting those wheels and making it do what it do, folks. This is just awesome. All Bronco models come with um, two different four-wheel drive systems, a base setup and an advanced 4x4 system. Now, the base system utilizes a two-speed electronic shift-on-the-fly transfer case, while the optional advanced system features a two-speed electromechanical transfer case that adds an auto mode for an on-demand engagement to select between 2H and 4H. Now, power is distributed by a Dana 44 Aventac solid rear axle and the Dana Aventac independent front differential unit, both with available Spicer former track electronic locking differentials and that's what makes this straight up awesome folks there's so much to know and it's so rich this ford bronco it's also available with the uh, segment first trail 2 box which gives the owner this suite of exclusive technologies including trail control which is essential cruise control for low speed driving on the trails now trail turn assists are what people call the front dig Titans off-road turning radius through torque vectoring and trail one paddle drive, which is awesome. Accelerator and braking control makes a one precise confident slow mode rock crawling. So, so when you let off that gas, you know, it's going to break and it's just going to stay right where you had it. That's just straight up awesome. I mean, you can actually <laughs> stop the vehicle and actually get out of it. And actually, you know, get out and actually walk around and it just stay there. And then you just get right back in, and just hit the gas and just go driving off. That's going to look awesome, folks. I can't wait to see that on camera. The Bronco also sports the best in class 11.6 inch ground clearance, a maximum of 29 degrees breakover angle and a 37.2 um, degree departure angle plus the best-in-class water fording, 33.5 inches, which is awesome. Now, underneath, 
um, especially design and strategic place steel plates, protect the Bronco critical components, higher capability models come with the available rock sliders, uh, front badge plate, um, shields for the engine, the transmission, transfer case, and the fuel tank. So Bronco is doing it and they have just made this baby, they have thought about everything. I mean, I was watching one video and I seen some articles where the engineers just beat the living daylights out of the Bronco so that we don't have to. And we can feel confident taking it out in the great outdoors and getting back tied back to nature and getting getting back our minds and our hearts back to nature, being able to touch the ground. Bronco is just there as an instrument to get you back, to get us back grounded into uh, people who care about other people getting us back connected into each other so that we can become, you know, one, like a cloth threaded together. And this is what's awesome about this SUV. And this is what's awesome about humankind. Let's get back to nature and let's get back to the Ford Bronco. It's Bronco, baby, and have an awesome day. Remember, like, share, and subscribe. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and subscribe for more interesting videos.